Hello everyone, welcome back on the Stemo channel. Guys, I'm Ram Gessing, Unity game developer, YouTuber and blogger. So in today tutorial, what we are going to learn is that how you can change a material of a maze at a runtime. Yes, friend. So this is a basic scripting and uh, this is a very important because in one interview I got to know when I had one year of experience. So they asked me to write the script and that was a very simple script so let me share with you if you don't know anything about this and if you are new on the channel make sure to subscribe the channel and hit the like button if you want to ask anything so just drop in the comment box so that will really help me a lot so let's start the today video so first of all we have one cube i have taken one cube here you can see this is the one cube and this is the plane so basically we are going to perform on the cube and here i have created two materials material one material two and in one game object in a one 3d maze you can put many materials you can see there is one material you can also put one more materials you can put many means it's depend on your baking at, uh, which material is looking on the cube currently it's not baked lower material is looking on the cube when you add directly here material so that will be not reflected here you can directly mention here material if you want to many a material okay but what we want we want to change this material yellow material in red material at runtime so how we can do we have to write the code so first of all let's create one script that is the material change runtime and let's open this script so what we need first we need materials so we want to give reference so serialize field and after that you have to private material material one okay and just duplicate it and it is material two and what we want we want this serialized field i'm not using public i'm using private because i don't want to use this material in another class so the good practice is to use the serialized field okay okay so what we want we want to change material we want to add material okay so there is a many ways just let me explain if you want to change a single material here so just you have to write a single line of code but if you want to change the lots of material here so at that time you have to use this array also okay but currently i am showing you a single but if you want to use the whole materials you can see this is the materials material means many materials you have to use a loop to iterate materials but currently i am using for a single and this material on mesh render so you have to write mesh render and here you have to put dot air material and after that you have to pass tail 2 okay this is the code you have to write so you will not able to see it will be changed directly so i just want to write another matter that is public wide change material and just put this code here and invoke this method here how much time after after three seconds so basically this will change to material 2 and let's pass the reference we have not assigned this script so just assign this script on the cube and here's two material pass material 1 material 2 and currently material 1 is on the cube we want material 2 after three seconds so let's play one two three boom you can see this is now red now it is yellow one two three now it is red okay so currently the single material is changing it is the materials so thanks for watching have a good day and don't forget to like subscribe and share bye bye take care